introducing BrowserStack's very own MCP server, which gives you seamless access to our testing platform. Let's say I have an Android application, which seems to crash on Google Pixel devices. Let me take help from Claude on this. Since I have the BrowserStack MCP server installed in Claude, it is asking me which device in particular I want to test the app on. I think the latest version of Android with Pixel should be okay for testing. It's asking me to provide the path to the APK. Now BrowserStack MCP server will upload and install the app on one of our devices. This section is sped up in interest of time. Nice, now the device is ready, and I can use the calculator app on it, it just like on my personal phone. Over here we can see the Strack Trace to debug further. Let's see another use case, this time in Cursor. Over here, I have a Playwright test suite written in Node for a website hosted locally on my machine. Now, since I'm on a MacBook, I'm not sure if the test will pass on Windows. Let's ask Cursor to run the tests on the browser stack infra instead. Let me allow it to run the required MCP tools for this. Cursor is now going through the code base to understand which testing frameworks and libraries are being used, and then communicates with the MCP server to provision the required browser stack SDK in this project. Cursor has now correctly updated the package.json file to install the SDK, and also added a convenient entry point to execute the tests on browser stack. Let's go to our terminal and run the tests. Now, behind the scenes, we are provisioning the required infrastructure and executing the tests. You can see the different workers being spawned to run the tests. After test execution, our SDK provides a link to our test observability dashboard, which allows you to see the test execution details and also compare the tests with any previous runs. Now, if your test fails in the future due to any reason, just ask Cursor to fix it. Behind the scenes, it will use our test observability insights to get the latest run details and stack traces of any failed tests. This information can be utilized by Cursor to then fix your test suite. In this case, there was a configuration issue in the browserstack.yml file. There's a lot more you can achieve via our MCP server, and we are really excited for you to give it a shot. It's open source and available on GitHub right now. Thanks and have a nice day.